<clears throat> now that that's solved and I understand something, my my OBS manipulation skill has leveled up by one. We can continue. Tell me if the uh, balance is better now. What's that thing on your head? You're monsters after all. You can't fool me. What is it? Something seems to be happening in the ruins. What should I do? Then get going. You ought to check into it with your own two eyes. Uh, yeah, certainly. But, uh, no, I can't. I was told to stay here. Being here is my job. Kurumali can't make a mistake, or at least I don't think so. <laughs> What's wrong? Such a gloomy face. When a kid has such a face, I know. Did you break something? Well, sort of. I understand. I didn't see anything. I didn't even see any children. Of course, I didn't hear anything. Okay, let me bring the music back up. So I'm recording it at a different volume than I am on the stream, so I can just totally manipulate it however it needs be. Sir, don't be quite so indulgent, but an understanding adult is appealing. You can't look down on those three just because they're women. Those three are really capable. They were always at the top class at Academy. They are really proud. Wow, so you can't judge a book by its cover. I guess that's right. <laughs> Excellent. All right, let's get the hell out of here before we get arrested or attacked by another fucking rock monster. Where does it want me to go? Alright, we're running a lap. That's, uh, I guess what we're gonna do today. Just run laps. <laughs> okay, I, I, I've missed something. Because we're back where we started. Is the exit downstairs? Is that what I've forgotten? Oh, you have to hit R2 to switch. Yeah, victory laps! Do 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 mm hmm excellent. Most excellent. Move my face down a little bit because I'll be in the way of something almost no matter where I am. I can put it here. It looks like the text doesn't normally go that far over. Yeah, we'll do this for now. Someday I'll find where to put my head. I don't know. Though. You guys, if you have the opportunity, please be sure to uh, share the link around so we can try and keep it that three viewer average. My husband works at the factory, so I guess I can't complain. <laughs> hey, look, tell me where I can get some good to eat. Uh, excuse me, sir, but is that way, is that any way to speak to someone when you're asking a favor? <laughs> no, yes, I'm sorry. Oh, dear little girl can tell me the name of the restaurant in town. Oh, that's better. Now I'll tell you, the best place in town is the Seagull Restaurant with the shell sign. One moment. I need to do something as well. We had to actually hit enter on sharing this uh, post. We're trying to get people to come watch. Oh, there we go. What's happened? What? Oh, I exited on exit. That's not what I wanted to do at all. It looks like my objective isn't set at all. So I guess I go home? And tell mom about the weird shit I saw? I mean, that seems right. I'm a kid, so I should just go home and tell my mommy. 
Say, say, Justin, it's all great going to see Liette and everything, but do you know how to get to the new continent? Of course I know, you just need to get on a ship. Okay, then how do we get them to let us on the ship? Uh, well, we just... I know, well, we'll ask Mom. She's sure to know. Mmm, town of Parm. Nom 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 nom. Welcome home, Justin and Sue. Dinner's ready. Wash your hands and come along. <laughs> Say, Mom, how can we get a ship? How can we get on a ship to the new continent? What is this all of a sudden? Well, I always used to go back and forth on my own ship. Oh, that's right. You used to be Lily the Skull, right? Well, if you want to know about ships, why don't you go to the port? Oh, that's it. That, that's one way to do it. Come on, Sue. We're going to the port tomorrow. Anyway, Justin, today you're dirtier than usual. Where exactly were you playing? Oh, I wasn't playing. With an introduction from the curator, we went to the salt mines and we were doing scientific research. <laughs> You doing scientific research. <laughs> oh, now that's funny. Oh, what's so funny? I wonder what scientific research, <laughs> scientific research means anyway. The new continent is Alencia, right? Which is bigger, Alencia or Messina, where Parm is? Hmm, well, there's nothing on the other side of the end of the world. Hey, I know. The end of the world is where the continent on the new end, or it's continent, the world ends on the new continent, right? Hmm, but you know, there's something I don't quite understand. Is there really an end of the world? Now that you mention it, the curator praised you very highly. He said you were being very good. Yes! Now he might forgive me for breaking that statue. Hey, Justin, I didn't hear anything about that. What exactly did you do? Oh dear. Say, Justin, what do you think the end of the world is like? Well, we'll never know if we don't go. Let's go to the port tomorrow. You're so hopeless. Tomorrow I'll go myself and apologize to the curator. But you have to go to apologize yourself, too. Understand, Justin? Alright. We're gonna be on a boat starting tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, Justin. Are you ready to go? She is like a former pirate queen. I think maybe she has a different parenting approach than most. I'm gonna have a bite of this delicious pastry. Oh. Mmm. -hmm. Pretty good. Mmm. Damn it. Okay, so probably want to go, uh, it's over the bridge, right? Yeah. Over this way, I want to say. Maybe, no, maybe not. There's the bridge again. I forgot where to go. Is this it? Oh, that is a closed gate. That's probably the factory. Means maybe the port is over here? I think this is right. Yeah, nailed it. Nailed it, baby. Oh boy, giant work meeting. Well, we'll miss you. I hope you survive your giant work meeting without losing your mind. Save a Rooney.
Dun 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 Well, I'll probably want to maybe go out here? Perhaps? Hi, hey, Justin. Come to see the sea? It's calm today. Look, lots of ships are out. Say, Mr. Wren, how can I get on a ship to the New World? Huh? You mean the steamer? <laughs> I think I told you already. The steamer docks at night. Okay. On the other side of the sea, there must be a whole new unseen world. Wow, hearing that gets me excited. A whole new unseen world. Yeah, I'm gonna go. <laughs> I'm sure you'll go, Justin. I'd like to travel the world, too. Alright, what about you? Oh, I like the port. Lots of ships going in and out. I think of them as my children. Huh? Your children are ships? Oh, I'm a shipwright. I make ships, very good ones. I put my soul into them. It's uh, some advanced sorceress technique. Anyway. Hey, you kids. Passengers only past this point. Come on, go home. Oh, you think you're such a big shot. Can't you just let me in for a little? Yeah, insulting people is a fantastic way to persuade them. Oh, not another day of washing dishes. The pay isn't bad, but I get bushed. My hands get rough, too. I am a foundering ship. I love you. Guys. Hey, hey, why are you wandering around here? Did you lose something? Oh, I was just thinking of a line to set my girl's heart on fire. I'm finally going to propose to her. I'm going to win her heart on a romantic night at the harbor. Even if it is the rule of the sea, throwing people overboard in a barrel is no fun. Eh, that's what you get for trying to stow away without getting a steamer pass. Steamer pass? Ah, you can't get on the ship to the New World without a passport. Well, you don't even know that? Yeah, except for sailors and soldiers, everyone else needs a pass. Well, how do you get the pass? I want to go to the New World, too. Huh? Oh, getting one from someone else is the fastest way. I'm assuming that he washes dishes on the ship and is just not on the ship right now, I guess? I... think? I remember an old man in the cafe in North Parm telling adventure stories, showing everyone a smelly old pass. I think his name was Java. Oh yeah! Let's go to the cafe. Let's go to the cafe. 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 Go, 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 go. Alright. Um. Yeah, so. This is North Parm. And the restaurant should be like. Right here. Yeah, starting to learn my fucking way around. Finally. Hmm. Do I need to, like, sleep till night or something? Oh, whoops. I, uh, I didn't mean to... Yeah, I've still got things to do. So this is, I guess, not the cafe? So I guess I need to find... something else that is a cafe? That's a general store. Uh, maybe it's in the Blue Marlin. Hi, Justin. How's the Seagull restaurant doing? Oh, is North Parm a different place? Hello, Nerdette Designs, and your cute little white cat with a leaf hat emote. Welcome to the stream. Um, well, this is my only option, so I feel like North Farm has to be, like, in here somewhere. When I was about your age, I was out there working in the mine. Hmm, times have changed for the better. Working in the mines is tough on kids who just want to play. It was it unusual for him to drop dead? What? Felt I was gonna drop myself a few times, but every time your dad would come and help me carry coal. My my dad? What a fucking hero! Oh, no ticket gate. Um, so there's a cafe. 
Where is this cafe? Do I need to do something to pass the time tonight, or...? Oh, the cafe's the bar! Right? Because this game is Americanized, so there's no alcohol. Right? What do you guys want to bet I'm right? I feel pretty confident that I'm right. Which means it's actually on the other side of the... God damn it. I keep accidentally leaving town. Like, I don't want to do that. Okay. We're, we're going to figure it out this time. I'm going to not leave the town this time. Check this out. Check out my basic navigation skills, everybody. And some top level shit. All right. I almost did it again, but I stopped myself. Um. Yeah, the cafe's back here, right? Ah, uh, he better come back soon or we can't do business. Ah. Uh, hey, stay there. We want to see an adventurer who comes to this cafe. Can we come in, ma'am? Don't be silly. You're still a kid. Anyway, I'm busy. That silly boy. He took the key with him again. Huh? So someone took the key to the cafe and went somewhere, right? All right, I'll go find him for you. Oh, wow, you sure? Okay, if you bring back the key, I'll let you in tonight. Ah, that silly boy. He must be off at the harbor watching the seagulls again. Woo, fetch quest! Yeah! Mm-mm, sure does feel like the PSX era right now. Oh, but for me to let you into this room, I will need the angel statue. Oh yeah, I could give you the angel statue, but I need the green key card. Oh yes, to give you the green key card, I require ten gold pieces. God damn it. Probably this kid. Oh. Um. Alright, somebody watching seagulls. Mm. Goodness, excuse me. Yeah, my alarm didn't go off, which is why we started a little early today. It's also why I'm still a little bit asleep. No, that's the port are my children's guys. Oh, oh, this is him, actually. Key to the cafe acquired. The owner? Oh, you're talking about that woman. Okay, just leave it to me. Okay, well, strategy talk to everybody until it works was a successful mission. So, cheers to that. Nope. Whoops. That that was that was pretty hideous actually. That was really bad. Keep it going. Ma'am, ma'am, I found it. I isn't this it, the key to the cafe? Gives her the cafe key. Oh, yes, yes, this is it. Ah, oh, glad I could finally open the cafe. Thanks for all your help, you two. You got some good jellyfish stew in, so the customers will be happy. Oh, I'm so glad, ma'am. So as you promised. Okay, okay. I'll be ready to open in a little while, so come back then. So yawny. It has taken a long time, Mullen, and the difficulties have been great. Yes, I apologize, Father. There were unforeseen distractions. Refrain from giving me excuses. Just tell me the results. Did you find it? Forgive me, Father. I have not lived up to your expectations. I am prepared for the consequences. Consequences? Mullen, if you are not capable of producing results, who is? I can think of no one. Make preparations for the next strategic plan. Prepare to move out. Reasonable leadership? 
How often do you see that in a JRPG? <laughs> I'm prepared for the consequences. Hey man, you know, shit happens sometimes. Whatever. Why is General Ball in such a hurry? The plan was proceeding smoothly. He's probably just very tired. Father has his own way of looking at things. Your comments are not required. <laughs> Forgive me, Colonel. I forgot my place. Lieutenant Lean, I didn't mean it that way. Sir. Yes, sir. At any rate, we got nothing from the Salt Expedition. <laughs> Colonel Mullen? The boy who was amusing. Justin, I believe. Colonel? It has been a while since I've seen you laugh like that, Colonel. I was thinking that it would be nice to have at least one in our ranks with as much energy as that boy. At least we would be certain that things would never be boring. <laughs> Lean, prepare for departure. Destination Alencia. Oh yeah. Say, Justin, I can't wait to find out what kind of adventurer Java is. Let's go. Off to the cafe. Do -do 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 -do. Really? Is it necessary to start me back over here and make me manually run all the way to the place that I was in when I last had control of my character? Come on, man. Fuck. I keep leaving the town on accident. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm just a yawny baby. Yawning. Non-stop. For the rest of my life. Here we go. <laughs> hey, it's you, Justin. You want to mope with me? Uh, no thanks. <laughs> Why don't you tell me the story you always do, sir? I'm a story of pardon the old? Uh, okay, why not? <laughs> yeah, where was I? Uh, so at that time, you know, Parm was still rural. And men were all rough and rowdy, and no civilization or steam engines. It was a good life. There, there were pirates and, and, and adventurers. Wow, there were pirates? Sir, you were an adventurer, right? Were you ever attacked by pirates? Of course I was attacked. That Lily the Skull was dreaded by all adventurers. Wait, Lily the Skull? Could that be... Yup. Your mom's a menace to society, kid. Hey, here it is. I've never been to a cafe before. It's sort of exciting. It's okay, don't worry. No one's gonna get mad. Let's go in. Yep. God damn it. Ooh, my god. Someday I will not yawn every five minutes. Oh my. Welcome. New kids really helped us out. In gratitude, you can have whatever you want. Oh, okay, cool. But, uh, Miss Curlian, did you do. Did we do anything you need to thank us for? Don't you remember, Justin? You brought back the key to the shop today. What? That old lady? Was that you, Miss Curlian? That can't be. You didn't recognize her? By changing her mind and body with makeup, a woman is an enchantress. Oh, a woman is an enchantress, you say? Ah, <laughs> you have a, a way with words, little Sue. Anyway, looks like Java's not here tonight. Too bad. You can ask the other customers about him, though. Double cappuccino. Pippi! It's you, Pippi. What are you doing here? Didn't you know, Justin? Me and my two sisters, Farrah and Curly, and run this cafe. Wow, Pippi, you're really responsible. Justin ought to learn from you. Alright. Oh, this really hits the spot. This old world coffee isn't bad. So you must be from the new continent. You came by ship, right? Oh, that's right. The ship just came into port faster than I expected. If you like ships, visit the port. You ought to be able to see the ship that came, tied on, uh, came on tied up at the pier. Oh, oh, Java, you say? You must mean that self-styled great adventurer Java from Lek. Uh, not sure about self-styled, but please tell me about that, Mr. Java. Oh, well, hmm. uh, they say uh, young Java was the best adventurer on Messina, but since adventurer went out of style, his only joy has been hanging around the cafe telling tales. 
They took the adventurer away from the adventurer, so now he's holed up at Lek Mines. Oh, I didn't even know anybody lived up at the Lek Mines. Oh, that old man Java, he's so loud when he's here, but it's too quiet when he's not. Maybe I ought to take some coffee beans up to him at Lek Mines. Hey, dads. How ridiculous. We came all the way from the new world, but the excavation work is finished. Guess I'll tour the old world and go home. They don't have tourist traps like the end of the world. The end of the world? A tourist trap? Have you been there? Fool. No one's been there. I just saw it. I saw it. Oh, I just remembered. Uh, that Java forgot his wallet the last time he was here. Knowing you, I bet you want to go to the Lek Mines to meet Java, right? Hee <laughs> hee. You got it. Actually, I'm going tomorrow. Well then, could you take this to Java? Come on, please. Please. To get to Lek Mines, we just uh, take the train from the station, right? No problem. Leave it to me. Poof, 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 poof. Okay, Puffy, we get it. Puffy says he's hungry. Come on, Justin, let's go home. Is that what he said? Because I feel like he said poof, 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 poof. But, you know, classic. <laughs> Trope Rooney there. Alright. I should go. That's where the port is. This should be able to take us home, I believe. Like ride around over. No, come on now. All right, there's a general store, which means yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they, they, they haven't added JRPG mascot to Duolingo yet, you gotta forgive me, man. Puffy's happy again today. Puff, puff, puff. Oh, I see. Puff, 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 puff. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't quite know what he's saying, but I can tell that he's happy. My Zilly's food gives me the strength to haul coal another day. I feel like working hard. So what's the special today? Today's special is the full moon rabbit saute. I didn't order. Uh, God damn it! Okay, fine. Everything's good, so whatever. Hey, Justin. Wonk. Ow! Well, what's that for, Mom? Today my shoes aren't even muddy. What time do you think it is? It's so late. I was worried that you got hurt. I'm glad you two are home safe. Come on, eat before it gets cold. Yes, ma'am. I also can't do voices. Can't do two voices at once. You'll have to forgive me. Ooh, huh. <clears throat> now we know where Java lives, so tomorrow we might be able to get a pass for the ship, Justin. I wonder if he's a great adventurer. Oh, I can't wait to meet Mr. Java. You know that Mr. Java. He must be pretty scatterbrained to forget his wallet like that. Yes, sirree. Even I'm not th nearly that forgetful. But don't you always forget to feed Puffy? Right, Puffy? I heard that you're going to the Lek Mines to see Mr. Java, right? It's dangerous, so don't go. I guess it's useless telling you, though. You are the son of an adventurer. Promise me one thing. You have to promise to protect Sue. Remember that you are a boy, right? Pixel Pals does not condone gender role crystallization in this method. Of course, Mom. I am an adventurer. To get to Lake Mines where Java lives, we take the train, train from the station. Uh, I think Dad once said that there's no more coal in the mine in those mines. Take care of Sue, Justin. If Sue should get hurt, her parents will turn over in their graves. Oh shit, she's an orphan. Don't worry, Auntie. Despite tough appearances, Justin's pretty tough. Exposition. Good morning, Justin. Are you ready to go? Oh. Oh, 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 God. Oh. Oh.
Seized to soreness. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll head, uh... Oh! Yeah, that makes sense. I've been playing so much Ragnarok online recently that I actually just assumed all the stu starting gear had a value of zero. Like, straight up. Like, just without even thinking about it. <laughs> Okay. So we'll bounce on over to the general store. You can store at the store? What is this fucking advanced technology? Oh, I was actually right. Can't sell these things. Sell the mana amulet, though. We're gonna hold on to the wood pole for now, because it's our only mace-type weapon. Alright, so let's go ahead and store the crappy stuff again. Wait. Ooh! Shit's pricey. Sportswear. 48 move, eh? It's all good. Uh, I usually like to prioritize offense over defense in these games. sell the rock axe, I don't think. <clears throat> yeah, <clears throat> we'll hold on to the rock axe. Uh, yeah. We'll hold on to everything for now, actually. Okay. Um, now we need to go to the train station, I do believe. Oh, we gotta store stuff again, though. Well, the most uh, expedient place to store things will actually just be here. Not what I meant to do. Do 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 do. Cool. Uh, we can stash the wood sword also. Alrighty. We ride. We ride. Oh, it is, huh? oh man, someday I'll have uh, I'll have Skylar come on for a uh, guest stream and have him play Warlord so you guys can be initiated into that particular meme. Um, where's the train station? I've seen it before because I was like, I found it while I was looking for other stuff. Um... Is this it? No, this was the museum. Hey, there's something written here. Let's see. Museum temporarily closed for repair of Ikari. Oh. Yeah. Uh, awkward. Sorry, Mr. Curator. So, to be fair, we did find that book that said he'd already broken it three times, so I feel less guilty about it. Hmm. Wait, this is it, right? Yeah. 
Nailed it. Oh, there you are, Justin. Come to ask to see the engine room again. Not this time. Today I'm going to Lek Mines to bring something to Java that he forgot. Oh, must be something important. Don't worry about the tickets. Just today, it's on the house. Oh, really? Thank you, sir. That, oh, that was very nice of him. Thanks, nice guy. I guess, I guess being a kid does have its advantages, right? My boyfriend's finally coming back. Getting excited from just waiting is the privilege of a girl in love. Oh, the reunion of separated lovers. How romantic. Isn't adventure exciting enough? Sue, how do you know anything about love anyway? How rude to say such a thing to a charming lady. Jesus Christ. All aboard! Please board now. The train is about to leave. Chugga chugga, motherfucker. The sense of wonder in this game is just, I love it, it's so much fun. It's just a lovely time. Oh no, I don't want you to miss your favorite part, that's sad. Thank you, sir. I'm not a sir quite yet. <laughs> oh, I can't keep up with these kids. I need to find some way up. Oh, okay. Not what I meant to do. <sighs> um, I mean, because, like, it clearly it wants me to go here, but I can't, so there's got to be a way up or something. Or maybe it's just not actually leading me to anywhere I care about going. What is this? This is just like... This is someone's house, right? That came up so fast I literally could not read it. Huh? No one's home. How careless. Oh well, I'll just leave his wallet here. Boop. You! Who are you barging into my castle like this? Why, well, you're a couple of thieves. G get away from my wallet. Yeah, sir. Oh, no, I got it wrong. We just, we just came to get a pass. N no, Justin, he'll misunderstand you. His wallet, his wallet. Oh, <laughs> ah, you let it slip, did you? You can't be too careful nowadays. Come on, give up quietly. I'll cut out your rotten hearts. Say, <laughs> Justin, is this man really Mr. Java? Sure he used to be an adventurer? Hey there, little girl. Used to be an adventurer. Bah! Used to be. Ah! I'm an active adventurer even now. You you have really good ears. Hey, excuse me. Uh, We came to ask you a favor, Mr. Java. Uh, actually. And that's the story. Oh, I, I see. You want my past to the new world. Uh. Now, boy, let me ask you one thing. What will you do on the new world? 
Oh, I want to go east. I'll head for Angelo, waiting for me on the new word world. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Angelo, you say? Ah, <laughs> oh, takes the king. <laughs> oh, c c come on, it's it's no joke. <laughs> um, ah, sorry about that. So, uh, Angelo. Angelo really exists. I know it. I understand you just fine. Depending on the circumstances, I might just give you my pass. Oh, whoa, whoa, really? So, so give me. Thank you. Don't be ridiculous. Who said you're getting it for free? Overcome the trial before you, and you may get that which you desire. That's the way of an adventurer. <laughs> All right. I'll take on that trial. That's right. No problem. Right, Justin? Well said. Listen, never lose that spirit. <laughs> well, I'll give you a trial. Follow me. We're going to the mines and back. Come on, no dilly-dallying. Okay, so it's, uh, okay, now he's cleared the way. This is the entrance of Lick Mines. Monsters have begun living somewhere back there. I can't stand their noisy groans. If you manage to slay their boss, I'll give you my pass. This is my trial for you. Uh, it's sort of dark and forbidden. <laughs> no, it's a mine, so of course it is. You just gotta give up and go home? Y you're, you're joking, of course we're going. But uh, Java, can you stay here till we get back? Uh, all right. Show me your spirit as a beginner adventurers. Eh, you want to go now or you want to rest first? Save game. That's what you want to do. You want to save the game. You always want to save the game. Always be saving. ABS. Alright, let's do it. Bro, oh no, mm. why am I eating when more people came to the stream? Hi everybody! Oh my god, what a terrible timing. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, alright. You guys, nobody saw anything. We're going in the mines now. Okay, so there's like a triangle passage thing. Uh, always go right first. That's a good rule. Hey, look, more cash. I'm sure this isn't left here because people were murdered in cold blood by monsters. Oh my god, monsters riding minecarts. How awkward. Uh, okay. Uh, let's use a move, since we have the points to do it, to get the extra XP. Ooh, these guys are tough. I guess now we're going to find out how much two attack actually really makes a difference. Oh, okay. The answer is it makes a pretty huge difference. slash. Um, I think we can actually evade this when we have enough time. But I feel like if we run past him, he'll actually fail to hit. Yeah. Solid. Get sorted. Nice. Alright, good way to start a new dungeon. Flawless victory. Oh, she uses a little hammer space mallet when you equip her with a mace. That makes me really happy. That makes me, like, unreasonably happy. We did it! Alright. Off to a very good start. I bet we're gonna unlock magic soon, right? Like, we have to unlock magic soon. Or maybe that's something that is on the new continent. I don't know. We'll find out. 
Yeah. I believe I got the initiative again? Nope. Standard fight. Ooh, I didn't know that the spider spelled with a Y. That's much scarier. <laughs> Alright, let's clear these guys out. Um, I think if we line up a crit here, this might get me a cancel. Ah, oh, very close. I mean, that was very, uh, like, a small number of ticks away from being canceled. Ooh, oh my lord! This shit got hard, all of a sudden. Um, let's evade again. Alright, let's clear the spider out. Oh, come on! We go. Uh, and she can do a rah rah on herself. Oh, it heals everybody. Okay. Well, regardless, she needs to do it because that was a lot of damage that she took. Oh, it's so cute. The healing is real. Jeez. These orcs are no joke, man. I mean, I did choose to upgrade uh, offense over defense, so... I suppose this is the wage of such a decision. Alright, we won! Bum bum. Ruber boot. Guys, we got Ruber boots. Ooh. Okay, so increases your defense, but greatly decreases your move. Those will be better for when she is a ranged fighter again. What is this? Oh, grenade. Alright, so we've explored this way. We need to go the other way. All right, we back in the saddle, boys. Boys and girls, ladies, gentlemen, everyone. Uh, all right, so even Sue should be able to two-shot these things. Oh, cool, sword level up for Justin also. Wait, did he split? No, he's just got a really weird animation right now. Bonk, bonk. Okay. Weird that there's such a big difference in, uh, like, power level between the orcs and the other monsters in this dungeon. I wonder if that's... That's just weird to me. But anyway, I see we've got a few more people in the stream. Welcome. We are glad that you can join us. Oh, God. Oh, boy. My initiative? Hell yes. Um, I uh, probably want to clear this out. That's the right thing to do. And then have him maybe hit the baby bat. Because then if we're lucky, he'll go kill the other baby bat. Nope. Oh, instead he wasted his attack completely. How awkward. That's very awkward. Oh, no! Don't ever fucking use a move called Sticky Fluid. Just don't do that, ever. That's just totally inappropriate. Got the cancel. Very nice. Alright, and then we'll clear him out. Boom. Boom. Um... 
probably try to hit him and then get Sonard in the face. Yep. God, so brutal. Difficulty level. Oh my god, he's asleep now. Jeez. Shit really hit you with a 0 to 60 in terms of difficulty level, right? Like, god damn. Okay. Oh, next combat I'll make sure my face isn't in the way of important combat stuff. Uh, that's like mine's too, so let's check this last little area here. Oh wait, there's no last little area. That's it. So that's full clear. Law 2. Shall we go? Okay, so let's uh, pick up these bags of money, I guess. That's a thing. Sleems! Oh yeah, no, my face is in a perfectly good place. Um, hmm. Tag this one. Yeah, I'll tag those two down there. Oof. Right, I can kill that one before it gets another turn. Nice. Alright, everything seems to be stable. Oh, I got some herb. If you know what I mean. I'm referring to medicine, which is one of the most important advancements in human society. What what other meaning could there possibly be? Yeah, back for 20 minutes. Reprieve from your fucking meeting hell. <laughs> Which one of these I attack? They're all gonna be pretty close to identical for most purposes. Uh, can I outspeed this with my animation? Yes, I can. Very nice. Boop. Boop. No, oh, Justin's a little low. I didn't realize he was at 17. All right, we we'll do a uh, we'll do another raw rush here next fight. Boom ba da 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 Yeah, they should just hire me to do all the music for games. I'm just I'm so good at it. So good. Okay, okay. Take a look. Uh, that goes nowhere. That goes across a pit. So let's uh let's try and complete this side of the pit first. All right, done. <laughs> so we need to go across here. And we can swing right and start. Oh, can we get initiative? Well, he hasn't seen us yet. I don't know if that's good enough. He wasn't, he wasn't, yeah. I was hoping that would work. He wasn't flashing red, so I figured that meant we'd, we'd gotten the surprise round. Uh, let's do that rah rah. Oh no, I don't want to be the police academy guy. <laughs> Come on, puppy! Oh, it's so cute. So we're able to 
would get like a pseudo cancel there. And I'm just gonna beat up on her, which kind of sucks. Okay, um, we'll hit E. They are a good bit slower than us, so. Yep. Excellent. Got him. Back up at a good solid uh, HP base. Things are looking all right. I do love the the chill baseline for this. Get the initiative, yeah. I'll pull up, probably blow up the orc with a V slash. So many speeders. Go, 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 go. Uh, yeah, let's take the V slash. Oh my god, did I really waste the turn? Do I still lose the SP? No, I don't. Okay. V slash! V slash! Probably doesn't kill him. Oh, two HP. Oh, no. With the sticky fluid, stop. Oh, this is going to hurt a lot, isn't it? Oh, sweet Jesus. All right, we can actually leave the orc, though. She can finish off the orc. Oh my god, this camera. Oh, we were doing fine on HP and then, then that fight happened. Alright, we won! Brutal, brutal, brutal. Alright, let's um let's hop out here real fast and check our weapon skill levels on Justin. Because if he has sword six, then we're gonna want to swap over to uh, the axe for a short time. Try to get his new uh, move. Uh, he's got sword level five, and actually we don't want to switch to axe. We need to switch to mace when he gets sword level six. Which is a little awkward. We'll probably put her back on her bow and hand the metal bat to Justin actually, rather than go to using the wood pole. Uh, okay. Check back this way. This will not be initiative, I don't think. This should be a normal fight. Yep, yeah, that's a normal fight. It had to think about it, but it's a normal fight. Okay. So, we probably want to have... Probably want to do the rah-rah chant uh, first. Oh, shit. Never mind, need to go in there and beat some ass first, apparently. Get hyped up enough to do the round watch yet. Okay, we're not going to, uh... Oh, so leveling your weapon also gives you max SP? That makes sense. Can you do round watch yet? Yeah, you can. Um, if he winds up a critical, she might finish Rah Rah. Perfect! Come on, puppy! Oh, nailed it. I feel like I should end that with a dab, but I'm not. I refuse. That, that would be the, the modern version of it. All right, we won! It would just be her dabbing using Puppy. Yeah. There's a fan art idea, right? Okie dokie. I hit the middle bat. I wonder if that's good enough. Or if it has to be the back bat. Back bat. Bat, bat, back. I guess the middle bat's good enough. Oh my god, so many baby bats. 
No, oh, that's not at all what I wanted to do. Hitting left one time did not, I would not think, would bring me to the completely other group, but so it's going by letter and not by map position. So they're going to over and hit for like twos, which is fine. Not a big deal at all. All right, we won! Yeah. These post these post battle screens are awfully long. Just awfully long. <laughs> oh, chest. What awaits us within? Back to the office. I mean, I feel like that's almost universally true, Zornis, that people are more comfortable in their beds than in their offices. Okay, cool. So she can use the mining hammer, which gives me the metal bat as a backup to replace the mining hammer. I've got a second good mace weapon, is what the really long-winded thing I'm trying to say here is. <laughs> um, so he'll have, he'll have sword six pretty soon. When he has sword six, then we'll switch to the mining hammer. Just take me across, or is that how I got here in the first place? I think it's actually how I got here in the... F no, this is different. Make your bed your office. I mean, isn't that the dream? Alright, this is where we came in, right? That downward slope. Yeah, no, I totally agree with you. The the pacing of some of the UI elements in older games is just absolutely abysmal. Valkyrie Profile uh, was an exception when we played that on the stream. Um, it it went it went by very fast. Um, and by the way, for those who are interested, the whole Valkyrie Profile playthrough is on the YouTube channel now. So that is cool. It's still a straight stream rip, and the quality production quality was not nearly as good back then because I didn't understand a lot of the things that I understand now. But nonetheless, it's there. There's some funny stuff. Give it a watch. Yeah, a lot of it is definitely loading because they moved discs. I remember, I actually distinctly remember being younger and being like adamantly anti-disc and being adamantly pro-cartridge because of loading times. Like, you know, part of it was also sour grapes because I didn't have a PlayStation. <laughs> so I was like, I don't want a PlayStation anyway. Mm, uh, 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 CDs are inferior to cartridges, so uh, I'm happy with my Nintendo 64. Um, but I wasn't because I really wanted more RPGs. <laughs> Uh, sour grapes. Okay, free fight. Straight up free fight. No, don't get me wrong, I'm still pro-cartridge, but I remember being violently pro-cartridge in my youth. <laughs> I, I, was, I was kind of a, a militant pro-cartridge activist. This is a new shield. Ox shield. Oh, no, no, it's an okay shield. Guys, we found an okay shield. It's okay. Not the best. Ah. <laughs> Hey, what did you find on your adventure? Eh, we found like a... It's like an okay shield. What? <laughs> so hopefully she bonks that one and then... Okay, whatever. It turned out alright. What a cinch! They crossed each other up, but it ended up working out alright, so I don't really care. Here we go. Does she level slower than him? That's weird. She's lower level, but needs more XP to level. That's bizarre. That means, yeah, that's got to mean something. I don't know what yet. 
bum bum. Gotta be oh. I was just gonna say it's gotta be boss fight time soon, and now I'm hundred percent sure about that. How to learn killer moves? Killer moves can be oh no, that's not that's not uh, a colloquialism. Killer moves can be learned by raising the weapon skill levels. The killer moves can be learned are different depending on the character, weapons, and magic spells. It's important to build up the skills required in order to learn killer moves. Look under skill in the command window to determine which skills are needed to learn a killer move. Killer move, Jesus Christ. That uh, it's a lot of a, that's a lot darker aesthetically than just moves. <laughs> Um. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Oh shit, there's like all sorts of shit all over the ground here. We found a legitimate fucking monster layer here, guys. Twelve-year-olds need to learn those killing moves, absolutely. Does he talk or is he just a fucking orc? Okay, he's just a fucking orc. All right, bitch, let's dance. I'm fucking ready. Orc king. Oh, this this escalated quickly. Um, fire breath. Fire breath. I gotta hit him before he hits me with that fire breath. Um. Oh my god. You know what, guys? I'm trying to break. Oh, never mind. It's not sure. Damn it. He's. That means he's. Fuck. Okay. I was gonna say I'm gonna try to break myself of, of my my terrible habit of um like always using always not using my consumables. And I was gonna say like okay, I'm gonna break myself of that habit right now. And then, well, holy fuck. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Ow. All right. Where's that grenade? Oh, that's not very good. It's only 30 damage. What? All right. Um, let's V slash. Let's V slash this guy out. Since I've leveled up swords since I did 68, I think this should kill him. I might be wrong. Variants might get me here. Nope. Damn, I was wrong. This is awkward. In the extreme. Uh, we're just gonna have to go ahead and charge the Ra Ra chant right now. Hopefully this doesn't kill anyone. Cool. Alright, so we immediately get the Ra Ra after the fire breath, which is good. Okay, who's defending? So we can kill both these orcs right now. Oh my god, really? Nice. Good job outspeeding that orc there, Sue. And now we're just gonna juggle this guy on initiative forever. I like how she kind of like plants her feet and like scoots around a little bit like, oh, I'm about to fucking ruin you, Orc. Orc King. Um, oh, we'll get another Ra Ra soon. We'll just have to take this. I'll learn those killing moves. Boom. Boom. She's slightly faster, which means if we... He's gonna action defend. Wow, weird. And cancelled. Um. Should be able to throw two more V slashes this fight, actually. V slash! Okay, so let's learn a little about how defense calculations work. The answer is, uh, he took the exact same amount of damage, so he only has more HP. Strange. What, what, what does that tell us about the defense calculations? tells us the monsters just don't have defense scores, but that doesn't All seem right. right. Big win. 
for us. Although everything takes roughly the same damage, so maybe monster. Whoa. Money, 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 money. That's exactly the number of points for Hiddle. Now look, she needs like a whole extra fucking 100 XP to level up, and she's behind him. And he's better than her in every way, other than like she has one more vit than him. Which is, by the way, weird. Like he even has more, he has more everything. What the fuck, man? Kind of weird. We did it, Justin. Now Java will give us the pass. What? Oh shit. Oh, this looks bad. We'll be buried alive. Run, Sue! First, get the bread. Get the bread. Slowly pick the bread up and spin it. Oh, it's a defense seed. I'm actually really glad I took the time to get that. Is this a treasure chest? Nope. Just looks like a treasure chest. Oh, fuck! Why didn't I bring my escape rope? Oh, cool. Java's here. She'll either die or have some sort of insane protagonist power. Why not both? Oh, what are you waiting? I can't remember what voice I do for this guy. What are you waiting for? This way, get over here. Hey, it's Java. Oh, well, wake up and get going. This mine is collapsing. I think it's roughly the voice I used, right? Oh shit, minecart minigame. We Super Mario RPG now, baby. Music's fucking dope, though. Oh, dude, cutscene! Dude, Thunderbolt Fantasy is weird, though. Don't feel bad. So like, I know this probably doesn't look like much now, but I just want to remind everybody to consider this in the context, which is, um, so this game was actually released mm, in 1997. So I just want you to remember that when you evaluate how cool this cutscene is. So this game was released literally 20 years ago. December 18th, 1997, okay? Just keep that in mind. Listen, a first-rate adventurer never gives up until the very end. But you didn't quite think about how to escape. I'm disappointed in you two. What, so we failed? But we worked so hard. Now let me tell you something. A real adventurer never loses hope, regardless of difficulties. Once you get to the new world of Valencia, don't forget those words and devote yourself even more. Huh? So, Java, you're... Yeah, you do have a little promise. <laughs> I'll just say you passed. There, a pass to the new world. Take it, Justin. Steamer pass acquired. Y yes! Now I can go to the new world. All right, how cool. Uh, maybe it's my imagination, but isn't this sort of stinky? That's because it's soaked with my blood, sweat, tears, soul, and a few other things. <laughs> oh god, y'all, yuck. Listen, Justin, you've now received your wings. These wings are yours alone. My own wings? But don't forget, in times of real difficulty, an adventurer does not rely on a pass. You must rely on your adventurer's heart. Rely on your heart to support your body and move your feet ahead. Promise me, Justin. Someday, tell me your own adventure stories of a world I don't know. I'll wait as long as it takes. Sure, I promise, Java. I I'll be going. Thank you, Java. Isn't it great, Justin? Come, we can't be doing this. Let's go. Can't be doing. What the fuck does that sentence mean? Let's go back to Parm, Justin. I need to stand here dramatically for another couple minutes. Um, Java, can I ask you about something? I know. It's about that little girl, as everyone says, right? There's only one thing I can say. The adventurer walks alone. Understand, Justin? What's wrong, Justin? Let's go home. Sorry, sorry. Thanks for the pass, Java. I'll treasure it. 
Goodbye, Java. Take care while you're waiting. Oh no, Justin, don't ditch her. That's the worst. That would be the worst possible thing you could fucking do. Don't be that guy. Oh no. I'm gonna be really sad if that happens. What's wrong, Justin? You were so excited on the way there, but didn't say a word on the way back. Is that right? Uh, it's nothing. <laughs> say, what's the new continent like? I can't wait. Oh my god. If she became the big bad of the game because she got ditched in fucking hour five, that would be amazing. <laughs> Our real adventure is finally gonna start, Justin. It's gotta be rough now. Dot, 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 dot. You have to say goodbye to everyone. They're gonna be so surprised. But you know, if both of us go away, Aunt Lily's gonna be lonely. Sue, so, I plan to go away without saying anything to mom. You be the one to say goodbye. Huh? What do you mean by that? I don't understand, Justin. Java said it too. From now on, the adventure is no game. Sue, you stay here. <gasps> What's this all of a sudden? Listen, Sue. We go everywhere together. We do everything together. I thought we'd be together. I've already decided. I won't take a child along. You require so many experience points to level up, it's really ridiculous. And if you do the math, you'll end up several levels behind me by the end of the journey, which will make you both a liability to yourself and to my success. I just can't allow that, Sue. You should have picked a better character class. The steamer leaves at dawn tomorrow. You don't need to come see me off so early in the morning. I'm not a little kid. I'm not. He says while crying. Without me, you'd never even have gotten the steamer pass. Don't you realize that? Sue... I mean, that's totally fucking true. <laughs> well, forget you. I hate you. That's, uh... <laughs> I won't take a child along. I say this as a slightly larger child. That's <laughs> 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 totally true, though. I promise, Sue, I'll come back a full-fledged adventurer and also asshole. And on my next adventure, I promise to take you along. Huh? Justin! Nope. You traitor! Jesus. Oh! <laughs> I like how she came back just to fucking physically abuse him. <laughs> that seems to be like a, a thing that happens to Justin a lot. I won't take the child along. I say this is a slightly larger child. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay, so we need to go back across the bridge. So, I guess we're just gonna go home and pretend we're not leaving and then leave? Is that. Is that the strategy here? Like, come on. Um. Why am I so bad at navigating this town? Hey, Justin, something wrong? I just passed Sue, wailing as she ran the other way. Ah, oh, it's you, Gantz. It's nothing. Nothing at all. Huh. Oh, you have a lover's quarrel. Keep that up and Sue's gonna be my bride. <sighs> hey, can, can I ask you to take care of Sue? Huh? Uh, what's wrong with you, Justin? Anyway, since I got wiped out last time, I'll think of another challenge. Remember that. Yeah, man. Whatever, dude. Hey, Mom. I fucked up. Welcome home, Justin. Dinner's ready. We're having your favorite stew together. Today. Whatever. What's wrong? You always say, Really, stew? All right! And get so excited. 
It's not the same without Sue around. Did you do something to get her mad? I don't know what started it, but you ought to apologize, being older. You understand? Well, eat that. It's been quite a while since we had dinner together, just the two of us. Not bad once in a while. But, you know, it's sort of lonely without Sue around. Ask her to come over tomorrow. It'll be okay, Mom. Sue will be coming over tomorrow. She'll be coming over all the time. Stew today's really delicious. Never had such delicious stew before, ever before in my life. <laughs> oh, such a fuss. Fuss. I make this all the time. This is one of my best dishes. Fuck, what is going on? Uh, well, it's just... Anyway, today it's extra special delicious. Extra special. Okay, okay, I see. You're such a strange kid. It's just the same as always. Anyway, Mom. Where do we keep our photo album? Photo album? I think it's in the chest of drawers over there. Y you think my birthday picture's there? The one with me swinging the sword around? So cool. I think so, but what's the matter all of a sudden? Come to think of it, steamer to the new car continent leaves tomorrow morning. You want to see it off? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, what's wrong, Mom? Why do you say that suddenly? Oh, well, right now you're still a kid, but in a few years, Justin, you might leave on an adventure too, so I... <sighs> Awkward. Say, Justin, why don't you sleep with me tonight? Come on, like you did as a baby. Uh, I'm sorry. What are you talking about? I'm not a baby anymore. No matter what, not today. Uh, don't take it so serious. I'm just just joking around with you. You're just too funny. You made me laugh so hard I have tears in my eyes. Um, actually tomorrow I'm, I'm well. I'm gonna turn in now. Tell me about it tomorrow. Good night. Um, right. Good night, mom. Oh, she knows. She straight knows. She's so fucking wise to his nonsense right now. Um, I was gonna say, man, PSX just took a strange turn, but it seems to be working again now, so that's good. Hmm, guess that's everything. Guess it's goodbye to this room too. All right. Father, I'm sorry. I couldn't tell mom after all. She fucking knows, man. Don't don't Father, don't joke with yourself. Father too. She I'm saw right through continent. you. I'm going to travel the world just like you did. Oh my god. How old is the Thanks is this kid? Spirit stone, father. I, he's got to be 12. Like maybe 13. The stone told me that Angelo isn't a myth. It's on the new continent. Oh god. Oh, okay. Now I know. <laughs> Jeez. You must have felt like this on the morning of your first adventure too. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know if he was, like, a total jerk-ass to the person who's Father, responsible for him being able to go. Do you... do you think I can really be like you? Everyone that Mom tells me about was much stronger. And much braver than me. So dramatic. And much smarter, too. Hey. Much... much... more like an adventurer. Yeah. Yeah, dude, you're still a kid. <laughs> Hello, Spirit Stone. You're right. What? This is nothing like me at all. I'm sorry. Right, Father? Oh, okay. I guess you're talking to him now. I'll leave my picture here for you. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> I promise that I'll become an adventurer greater than you. So manly. Um, that is not... Goodbye, Mom. He totally just hit his hand, didn't he? I'm going. Okay, nope. 
It seems so dramatic that there had to be a fucking payoff. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. To the port, said the slightly larger child. Whoa, is it like foggy? That's a weird effect. Must be foggy. This is the exit. Not what I... Uh, someday I'll stop doing that, guys. Someday. I make no promises. Oh, hey, it's the intro screen song. How appropriate, right? Port is dead ahead. The next lookout in line in the young men's club caught cold. I gotta do it for a while. Isn't it tough getting up so early? It's a job, so it can't be helped. Our young men's club has to protect the town of Parm. Alright. I guess tutorial level over now, basically, right? You? You're the kid who keeps coming. I keep telling you, passengers only pass this point. I am a passenger. I even have a pass. It's a real one. R-E-A-L. Huh. Does look real, but it's old and it reeks of something. Uh, whatever. No matter. Passengers can't go back out once past the gate. Understand? Yeah, dude, I did fucking see that. Uh, uh it looks it looks like maybe some sort of beat-em-up or something? I just want to save real quick, guy. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Save game. Lek mines. No, oh, it's only Justin now. Am I ready? Let's fucking do it. Don't drink unboiled water, you'll get sick. Thanks, man. But I'm not so frail. I'm an adventurer. Okay, dude, whatever. I'm going to New Parm. I'm so glad to see my dad. Oh, it's so cool to be able to go to New Parm. I'm going to be on the same ship. Huh. Yeah, I guess, uh, I guess we'll find out more about it. They know how to build a hype, don't they? Yay, I'll be with you. I, do you know when we get to New Parm? Uh, well, um, actually, I don't know either. Get your sandwiches and coffee. How about some cold orange juice? That's right, I haven't had breakfast. But I'm going to let a little longer. I won't buy breakfast yet. My husband works at New Parm. He was finally able to bring his family along. I'm so glad that all three of us can live together as a family. Who are you with, boy? I'm alone, and I'm not a boy. I'm an adventurer going to the new world. I came to see off my son. He's going to the new world to become a chef. When I think of saying goodbye... Oh, I can't stop crying. Please, please come back alive. Don't get caught by pirates. This mom must be worrying about me, too. I gotta come back in one piece. All passengers are in. Maybe I'll get some breakfast at the Seagull. I'm going to New Palm to learn how to be a chef. But Dad is crying like a baby. I'll be back in two years, and these ships are safe now. The Age of Pirates is over. Blackbeard and Lily the Skull. They lived so long ago. Yeah, man. So long ago. They're definitely dead now. I got, I've got to work hard in New Parm, too. Miss, why exactly are you going to New Parm? Despite my looks, I'm a merchant. I'm going to New Parm to check out the popular clothes. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to. Oh, even if it's my job, I don't want to get on the ship. Oh, there are people like that. I want to get on the ship so bad that it hurts. You get seasick. Oh, just thinking about it. It's quite a talent. I don't envy you, though. Huh. You're the train platform, girl. What are you doing here? My boyfriend's coming home. Knowing him, when he sees me, he's sure to give me a big hug. Um, at the station, didn't you say he was coming by train? Are you waiting for a different guy? Of course not. I'm a one-man woman. You scum. Work your blimeys. We won't set it on time. Work or I'll cut your pay. 
Uh, excuse me, sir. What is it, boy? You want me to cut your pay, too? Uh, well, I don't exactly work here. Just want to know what's holding us up. I used to be an adventurer. The kids of today hate hearing about it, saying, Not again! Oh, I want to hear about it. I'm going to New Parm to become an adventurer. Oh, I'm so glad you want to hear the stories of an old man like me. I'm going to proceed not to fucking tell you. He gets really yelly very fast. Oh, Rosado, you see the Garlau boards have been keeping us busy with extra work. Uh, what are the Garlau fortresses doing on the new continent? No idea. Maybe because there's a lot of pretty women in the new world. I've never heard such an irresponsible army. One, two, three. All right. These are for first class cabins and those are for third class. Yeah, I'm Lightning Rick. Give me any job and I run away as fast as lightning. Wow. Wait, wait. Isn't that just slacking off? Personal comics RPG, you have stats rated in dice, qualities rated in dice, and stated health always rated in dice. So when you test, you roll all three and take the middle result. Weird? That's weird. I'll have to see that in action to, to understand the math behind it and, and have an opinion on it, because that seems weird. My name is AWOL Joe. I'm famous for being absent without leave since I was five. Uh, sounds like you're doing something impressive, but aren't you just slacking off? <laughs> well, they might say so on land, but just don't tell anyone you found me here. My name is AWOL Joe. I've been AWOL since I was five. Hey, you there! Have you joined the adventurers at such a young age? Wow! Terrific! Aw, oh, shucks. I'm sort of embarrassed when people say that. New world dreams, hopes, and new finds. The Adventurer Society is looking for a few first-rate kindred spirits. Oh, sea spirits, please protect our voyage from disaster and let us return safely. Uh, sir, what are you mumbling about? What? Oh, I was just praying to the sea spirits so that we will arrive safely at New Parm. This is my first voyage as sea working as a sailor. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm still an apprentice. And this is my first trip as an adventurer. I'm looking forward to it. I know what you mean. I'm so excited last night I couldn't sleep. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Eh, same here. Hey, look at that guy over there. Look, look, standing over there. The guy looking at the sea. Ah, uh, that guy? He, he is looking very serious. I wonder what's wrong. To me, it looks like he's thinking of jumping in. We gotta stop him. Uh, it's hopeless. I'm so tired. Huh, don't kill yourself. Oh, jeez, don't surprise me like that. You almost made me fall. I was just waiting for interesting bottles drifting from the new world. God damn. Hey, Justin. If you're here, you must be going to the new world. Aha, that's right. I see. You're following in your dad's footsteps to be an adventurer. Lily must be proud, right? Awkward. Goodbye. Is it go time yet? Yikes. A voyage to the new world? They say you'll get eaten by a giant turtle on the way. Then a hole in the ocean floor makes a whirlpool that sucks you down. Heaven help me. You boy, out of the way. Don't stand there. It's dangerous. Oh, sorry, sorry. Sir, you smell of salt air. A real man of the sea. <laughs> me, a man of the sea? Thanks, boy. To me, that's the greatest compliment. Oh, good morning, Justin. Today, my husband is going to sea, so I came to see him off. It's so early. My kid's still asleep. Oh, it is early. Mom's probably not even getting ready to open yet. <sighs> You're Lily's son, Justin. Haven't seen you in a while. How you been doing? Hey, I'm taking today's ship to the new continent. Wow, go to the new continent. Maybe you got a hold of a pass. Everyone, please get in line. Yes, yes, that boy there. Please get in line, too. A double file line. Okay, I'm in line. Raja, I shall take my leave days off and go on a tour of New Parma to be off duty and spread my wings. Soldiers go on tour too. Uh, young sir, how did you know I was a soldier? The way you talk gave you away. Okay, but for real though, can we get on the ship now? Let's do it. Hey, wait up there, boy. Yikes. Guess Java's pass was too old after all. Look, hanging out of your pocket. It's almost a signal to thieves saying, steal me. Huh? Oh, thank you. 
What a relief. I can't go back now. All right. There's a small technical difficulty, so give me one second to handle a thing. Aha. adventure what's this a letter how do I get in my pocket you there out of the way just keep standing there and you'll be knocked into the ocean geez fine I just have to move right this it's a letter from mom from Lily the Skull to Mr. Gauss, president of the Adventure Society, not to be read by Justin. Oh well, I'll read it anyway. He doesn't help his parents at all, spends all day playing adventure, comes home covered in bruises, gets scolded for his mischief, and brings home big bumps on his head. This hopeless, naughty little boy used to live at our house. One day this naughty boy cried. It was the day he found out he'd never see his beloved father again. Since that day, the naughty boy has become a greenhorned adventurer. That adventurer named Justin is friendly, simple, and scatterbrained. Can't say he's anywhere near full-fledged, but he's begun to walk on his own. On his own. When I see his single-minded figure in my dreams, I can proudly say, this boy is my son. Please, Mr. Gauss, please help this red-haired green horde adventurer, my son. Help him follow his dreams. Mom. Knew all along. No shit. Huh, there's more. Naughty, naughty Justin, knowing you... I thought you'd open this letter and read it. I thought you'd grown a little, but I guess you are still my naughty little boy. Listen, take care of your health. Your dad used to say, an adventurer's health is his greatest asset. And just one last thing. Wherever you go, try to follow your dreams with all your heart, but don't lose yourself. Goodbye, Justin. Hey, what you doing there? You're the last one. Come on, get on board. Don't let my son's dreams be memes. I'm entrusting you with this sacred duty. Mom, thank you. Goodbye. I'll be back soon. After approximately 60 hours of gameplay. <laughs> hey, thank you very much for the, uh, the donation, Charities Lady. I will try not to be attacked by pirates. I will do everything I can. Thank you so much. Five seconds later, we get attacked by pirates. So y'all ever heard of a little thing called the hero's journey? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Oops. Oh, shit. Just clicked that on accident. No, go away. Okay. Didn't disrupt anything. Excellent. I clicked the World of Warcraft larger launcher by mistake. Well, let's look around the ship. Hopefully, um, if things go well over this next month, we'll be able to get affiliate status relatively quickly. And then we can uh, have subs and bits and cheers and stuff. Ah, every day swab the decks. Even a newbie could do this job. Huh? Passengers? Uh, excuse me, can I help you? The cabins are just down the stairs. Steamer bridge. Steamer passageway one. I'm assuming this is where I need to go. I kind of remember this part of the game from my previous partial playthrough. Like, kind of. Come, brave adventurers. Unknown adventures await you. New Parm Adventure Society. Subs and dubs? Oh, shit. Adventure is awaiting me. Ah, now I can't wait to get a new Parm. Rats, it's locked. How much would it cost to stay in this room? The answer is way more money than any individual should have in a just society. Okay, steamer lounge. Don't go running around like that, you're bothering people. This ship is too small for kids. Uh, <laughs> I can't sit still thinking of all the adventures I'll have when we get to the new world. What's wrong, miss? You look sad. We're on an ocean cruise. I look sad. Uh, you think I'm ugly? Oh, I'm ugly, ugly, ugly. Wah. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, hold on. The new continent, Alencia. End of the world, countless ruins and mysteries in an expanse of nature. Yeah, my photographer's soul sheds tears of joy. I'm going to photograph it. My, my, where are your parents? Not here. I'm alone. I'm on an adventure to the new world. Oh, I'm going on assignment. I'm a newspaper rep newspaper reporter covering the new world for a special edition. Oh, boring, boring, boring. Parm was boring too, but this voyage is boring me to death. Oh, on ship, I thought I'd meet a handsome man with a nice smile, but with just a hint of mystery. That's really specific. I'm a wa I'm a wandering gambler. I've never lost, so I'm off to the new world to seek a worthy opponent. Wow, sort of like me. I too am off to the new world in search of adventure. My, my. You are wise for your years. In the daily grind of everyday life, thrills alone are the spice of life. I am known as the ultimate gourmet. I go anywhere to see a new restaurant. Spare no expense on a famous chef. I don't know, I guess it's really not gambling if you're that good, i.e. a cheater. But lately, I've grown tired of such tastes. Somehow, I feel empty. When I heard that I might find some delicacies I have yet to sample, I decided to head to the New World. Off to the New World for food, huh? Sir, you must really be a gourmand. Oh, my, my body feels so strange, sort of foggy. Hey, what's wrong? You there? Uh, this cute girl is just sitting right over there. A girl with a big ribbon in her hair. Oh, New Parm has an organization called the Adventurer Society that all the first-rate adventurers join. The president of the organization is, like, uh, really cool, they say. They say he's capable and smart and always comes back alive from any peril. Okay, so we know where all the rich people hang out. That's cool. That also means this is not where my fucking room is. It's probably over here. Boy, is the steamer fun. If you have any trouble, just come right to me. I've had no trouble at all. Nothing but fun. Oh, you lost? The ship is so big, it's hard to get used to it. The cabins are down the stairs. The deck and lounge are around the corner. That was a nice leave. Parm is a nice town. Sir, are you going back home to New Parm? 
Yes, my work on the Garli forces is waiting for me back in New Parm. 126, 127, 28. Just how many rats are there? God, I'm so bored on this ship. There's nothing to do but count the rats in the room. Really? There are lots of interesting things around the ship. I'm the ship's doctor. I take care of everyone on the ship. But the captain is so stingy, he won't hire a nurse. He thinks women shouldn't work on ships. Oh, I've heard that before. Isn't that one of the rules of the sea? Blech. I'm a man charmed by the new world. I've been to the new world ten times. I know what you mean. I've been wanting to get to the new world for so long. I finally made it this far. Knowing my boyfriend, I'm sure he'll give me a big hug when he sees me. Miss, you look pretty happy. Did something nice happen? Oh, he isn't back from the new world, so I'm going to the new world. A girl in love has no fear. Hey, boy. You believe in the end of the world? Oh, no, you say so. I've heard of it. <laughs> it does sound interesting. I will never forgive that man. I'll seek him out and make him pay for what he did. Uh, I'm sorry? Uh, okay. That's just gonna stay there, I guess. Hey there, boy. How are you? You gotta relax on a boat trip or you'll get seasick quick. Just look at how relaxed I am. Yoo-hoo. Look at me on a ship. I'm on a boat. Don't worry. I'm having more fun than I can stand. I got no time to be nervous. Sailors are sure cool. I'd like to sail the seven seas, hunting for treasure and fighting pirates. Hmm. Being a sailor isn't bad, but if you think about it, an adventurer can do that too. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. I'm gonna be an ocean adventurer. Yeah, whatever. Good enough. <sighs> yeah, I'm so itchy. I think this cabin has lice or something. Yikes, lice? I gotta watch out. Miss, you don't look so good. Are you okay? Uh, maybe you're seasick. The ship's doctor... Uh, oh, my chest aches and my head is spinning. Could this be love? What the fuck is with the people on the ship? Are you going to the New World? I'm coming home. I miss the town of New Parm. Sir, you're from New Parm? Well, tell me, what kind of place is New Parm? Oh, certainly. The sun shines all the time on cheerful adventurers. That's it. That's the whole thing. Tra la 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 Say, what you doing? Oh, I'm practicing my singing. I want to become a singer in New Parm. All right, let's go spend some of that orc cash we got. That orc money. Um, that's 13 better, but I haven't been in a situation where movement was a huge restriction. Yeah, we'll do that. That's worse than the oak shield. Let's just go ahead and do it. It's a pretty small investment, so. All right, let's check and see if they have any good weapons. Um, not really, no. Not that I don't already have, anyway. Um, nope. Okay, we're good. Let's store some crap. Once we get things stored, then we can uh, see about maybe uh, advancing the storyline here. Fuck you, grenade. Fuck you, wood pole. Fuck you, rubber boot. And these I should probably keep on me. I mean, that limited, limited inventory stuff's really gonna start to affect me. Now there's only one person in the party, huh? Mm. Awkward. Oh my my, you shouldn't be playing around here. Boy, where's your mama? Hey, just a second, ma'am. I'm an adventurer, don't treat me as a child. Oh, I see, you're playing adventurer. Just don't go out of sight of your mama. Jeez. Fucking shut down. Engine room. Oh, this is cool. I'm not gonna fuck around in here, though. <laughs> that, that seems like asking for trouble. Mr. Passenger, this is the cruise quarters. Please return to your cabin. If you're bored, why don't you visit the lounge or go up on deck? Okay, but like, I actually haven't found the, the like, passenger cabins yet, so like... I missed something here? 
Emer Passageway 1. Wait, what? I can move this? What? I can move this? That's weird. Is there any point to it? Second class cabin. Alright, I'm assuming that I just went down here the wrong way in the first place. That's the only real explanation. Oh, fuck. Huh? What? What? Why would Puffy be here? Oh, I can't believe it. Could she... God damn it. We went through all that work to not do the stowaway plot, and she's just gonna make us do the stowaway plot anyway. You motherfuckers. I am with Justin. So it is Sue. God damn it. Oh, silly. If you're gonna stow away, do it so you don't get caught. You don't seem to care at all. Don't be a fool. I don't want to see a girl die, either. Oh, Justin. Sue, why'd you have to come? Harm's no fun without you around, Justin. I want to go on adventures with you, Justin. And you can't just- you can't- you just can't do anything without me. Right, Justin? You fuck ass. Are you, Justin? You've really given us trouble. Such a wee little girl. The punishment for stowaways is being thrown overboard in a barrel. This is the divine rule of the sea. Please forgive her. Sue's just a kid. I'll make sure she never does something like this ever again. No. Breaking the rules of the sea brings the curse of the spirits. Come, pick up the barrel and toss it into the sea. Thanks, wait a second! They don't have to be so stingy. What's one more on a big ship? Do something, Justin. Oh, gee. You're shameless, Sue. I don't really like throwing people overboard in a barrel. So then stop them. But if someone breaks the rules of the sea, we have no choice. Hey boy, there's a stowaway. Might see him thrown overboard in a barrel. <sighs> hey, come on, don't say that. I don't want to see it myself, but throwing stowboards overboard in a barrel is the rule of the sea. Stowaway's some kind of rule the kind of rule breaker the sea spirits hate most. Oh, we're really busted. That suit's so reckless. Oh, that poor little girl. I feel sorry for her. When I was watching the weather, I found a stowaway this small. Say, how did you know that Stu Su Sue was a stowaway? When I asked her who her guardian was, she jumped up and ran away. Girl's quite a problem. I can't even get ahead in repairing my beloved crane, Elizabeth. The crane can wait, but not Sue. Please save her, sir. Eh, you're right. Women do need a lot of- What is with all the sexism in this game? Don't compare Sue to a crane, for gosh sakes. Throwing such a small kid in the sea in a barrel is just too cruel. Please, please spare her. Well, there is one way. Wait. Girl told her- Cole told me you want to be an adventurer, yes? Yeah, that's right. I want to be the greatest adventurer in the world. Me too, me too! Hmm. Adventurers are something kindred to us sailors. The spirits may not curse us. Alright. You can become sailors on this ship. Huh? If you were passengers, you'd be stowaways, but if you're sailors, then you can't be stowaways. How about it? Will you work on this ship until we reach the new world? If so, I'll spare the wee one. Well, that settles it. From now on, you two are apprentice sailors, understand? I understand. Uh, I'll be a sailor as long as I'm with Justin. Good. Take him to the sailor's quarters. Aye, aye, Captain! You two get plenty of rest. Starting tomorrow, we'll work you hard. Oh dear. Maybe this is the part I remember having to work on a ship. I guess I didn't get very far in this game after all. Which is good, actually. Good morning, Justin. How'd you sleep? Oh, I didn't sleep very well. That teeth grinding and snoring kept waking me up. I'm still sleepy, too. The bed was stinky and damp. and made me sick. And... Cut it out, newbies. Can't sleep all day. Get up and get working. Well, let's go. Listen close, newbies. Up until now, you were passengers. From now on, you're apprentice sailors. Don't forget that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
You two are in charge of swabbing the deck. You'll get instructions on deck. Now I'll give this to you. Key to quarters. Remember to provide service if a passenger asks you to do so. Understand? Good. Now go on deck. All right. Let's go on deck. All the music in this game just has like the dopest fucking drum line, right? Like All right, how to swab? Is it mini game? Ah, the apprentice is Justin and Sue. Coming to work without being called, and you certainly have promise. But you already know, but newbies always start by swabbing the deck. Ready? I'm gonna have you wax every nook and cranny of the entire deck. When you're ready, come to me. You two ready? We'll start now. You know how to do it? Nope, tell me how to do it. The secret good waxing is a balance of power and speed. Yeah, it is a mini game. We get started, press the X button. Press the X button to raise the power, increase the waxing speed. The power goes over the maximum when you get tired, so be careful not to keep the button down. Release the X button to decrease power. Good rhythm with the button will keep the power to your max. Key is to pace yourself. You'll get a nice reward, so don't slack off. You two ready? We'll start now. All right, I'm using my true rune of the save state. Feel like I'm doing well. I just I don't have any real frame of reference. Fuck. Oh, it's under 30 seconds. It seems decent. Go, Sue, go. Yeah. Silly. I love it. All right. Guess you did get you finished, but do a little better next time. Oh, this is pretty hard work. Can you do this every day? Cleaning is part of training. Oh, enough for today. Go back to your quarters and rest. Man, I thought I did pretty solid. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess this is our life now. Swab life. That's the engine pass away. That's not where I want to go. I want to go down here to the quarters. Yep. Did all your work today? Great, you look tired though. Get lots of sleep tonight. Oh my god. That was the that was like an entire day? Christ. Brutal. Ow. Oh. My body aches all over. Yeah, your muscles are just sore, Sue. You'll get used to it. I'll do more than my share of work today. Thank you, Justin. You two, what about work? You wanna give it a rest today? We're gonna save. Getting close to the end of our uh, of our session today. I might give you guys a few extra minutes since I started late again today. Tomorrow we're gonna start on time. God damn it! Ow. Sorry about that. Guess we go back on deck and swab some more. That's just our life now. This is our life now. Now it looks like another busy day. You two ready? We'll start now. All right, let's try it again. Let's see if we can do a better score this time. Fuck. Rough, man. Actually, we're going to restart this one. <laughs> Uh, the true rune of the save state rides again. Oh 
I'm focusing. Sorry. Not being funny right now. No! I'm so close! Ah, no! <laughs> All right, last time. We're taking this result no matter what. Fuck me. All right, I lied. Now, now it's personal. No, it's cool. It's cool. I'm fine. It's just a mini game. It doesn't matter, right, guys? Having fun, you guys having fun? Everybody having fun? <laughs> Fuck! Oh my god, this is so fucking frustrating. I'm getting worse. It's getting worse. Come on. No! I was doing so well. Guys, I'm gonna lose my fucking mind in this mini game. This is where I die. This is where I die. This is it. This is the end of the run. This is the end of my playthrough. I'm never gonna make it past swabbing the deck. Right, we're just gonna be conservative with it. We're just gonna. That was going well, too. We're just gonna do this. And we're just gonna be reasonable. We're not gonna let it go over. We're not gonna get super greedy. There we go. I really wanted sub 25, but I'm not gonna fucking restart it. Just a phone call. No, probably not important. Ah, swabbing. <laughs> oh goodness. This music is so misleading for how frustrating this game is. I promise. Pretty good job there. By this rate, by the time we all arrive, you guys will be pros at cleaning. Huh? Even though we're apprentices, do we have to clean all the time? Give us a more important job. Eh, keep this up and I'll think about it. Here's 25 gold for a good job. You finished today. Go back to your quarters. Hey, huh. we got paid. Good. The lens is squeaky clean, so the light will shine far. Hey, what do you use those that huge light for? Uh, don't you even know that? For signals. Sig sailors and adventurers use lights to signal to each other. Our guest will be on board soon, so we gotta send a signal to send a boat. My guest? In the middle of the ocean? Uh, of course, don't look surprised. Our guest is the greatest adventurer in New Parm. Uh, an adventurer? 
There are a few desert islands in these parts. Our guest has been searching for old treasure there. Uh, we're getting ready for the guest starting early in the morning tomorrow, so don't sleep late. Cool. The greatest adventure in New Parm. More cutscene, yay! That's kind of cute. Hey, Sue, what do you think the greatest adventure in New Parm is like? Think he might be a giant man with a shaggy beard and bulging muscles? Eh, yeah, he's got to have about five arms. Ah, she's half asleep. Wonder what I'll learn about, uh, learn of the Adventure Society. How to disarm traps? Tips for fighting monsters? Ah, can't get to sleep tonight. And then he immediately went to sleep. Nice consistency and message there, Justin. Solid work. Hey, hey, Justin! Get up or get chewed out. Hey, Justin! Uh, just a little more. You just count the ten. Don't give me that. Didn't they say not to sleep late because the adventure is coming? Oh! What are you doing, Sue? Come on, get going or leave behind. Oh, I was waiting for you. Yeah, yeah. Maybe like this? Uh, that guy, what's he doing? Oh, that's silly, he looks like a fool. Hey there, what are you doing? Oh, this this is the greeting of cool sailors and adventurers. You gotta learn to be you gotta learn it to be full fledged. No, yeah, you don't say. I gotta master it too. No no no, you scoop your hand up like this. But like this? Hmm, cool. Oh brother. Now you look like a fool. Yeah, alright. Hey, you're pretty good at it. Alright. I guess we go up on deck, right? To greet the greatest adventure in New Parm? I, I, I don't completely remember what happens here, but I'm pretty sure she's like a pretty lady. Let's see if I'm right. You guys are too late. Look, the greatest adventure in New Parm is over there. You ought to go say hello. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I actually kind of remember this. <laughs> I'm doing great. And the treasure, as you can see, it's just perfect. Vina, you've outdone yourself again. Oh, I'm we're for Scottish people. Smiling face. Long time no see, Captain. You look well too. Vina, I thought I'd never see the golden legacy of the legendary pirate Warren with my own two eyes. Yeah, those three <laughs> identical-looking boxes Isn't are very impressive. To tell the truth, I had a bit of trouble. I really like her hair thingies. It was one trap after another. To be fair. Whoever set them sure had a bad attitude. They might catch some bumbling adventurer, but they can't catch me. She's so cool. End, though, I thought I was done for when I had these giant boulders on my tail, but I quickly found a cave in the side and whoa, jumped whoa. in. Whoa, hang on. Let's not waste a good story. Let's go sit down. You can take your time and tell me about your adventure down below. Yeah. I'll have the men carry your treasure. Okay, Captain. Can you guys take care of this stuff? Yeah. Everybody loves Fina. Later. Huh? Who are you two? I've never seen you before. Oh, uh, well, uh, I'm just... 
Wow, a girl? The greatest adventure in the new world is a girl. That's so cool. And she's pretty, too. Right, Justin? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Captain, will you introduce us? Of course, Fina. These are our apprentice sailors, Justin and Sue. Hmm. My name's Fina. Pleased to meet you. Say, Justin, let's give her the high-five greeting. Oh, yeah, that, that's right. We just practiced it. I'm Justin. Pleased to meet you. Ah, <laughs> Ah, uh, didn't you know? That greeting is only for when you're full-fledged. Okay, for now, we shake hands. Save the high five for when you're a full-fledged sailor. Come on, Fina. Look, come on. Come, let's go, Fina. Don't be slacking off, eh, Justin? You two, good luck on your ship work. Well, shall we go, Captain? Ah, she treated me like a kid. But she's so cool. I'd like to be like her. Greatest adventure in the new world. Well, she is pretty cute. Hard to argue with that. That's spoopy. That's a spoopy noise. No, no fun at all. Cleaning again today. Don't give me that. Better I'm being tossed overboard now. It's your fault. Don't make me play the minigame again. What? Hey, it's already clean. Who cleaned the decks for us? Hey, you two, it's about time. Never be a full-fledged sailor if you can't get up on time. God damn it, she's so cool. Good morning, Justin and Sue. Looks like a hot one today. Huh? You remembered our names? I'm shocked. Ah, first-rate adventure needs an excellent memory. Or I'd like to say so. I heard about you from the captain, so I thought I'd talk to you. Thought I'd talk to you while swabbing the deck, but you took so long to get here. At this rate, you've got a long way to go to be a full-fledged sailor. Jeez, you're pretty tough. But I'm an adventurer, so that's okay with me. An adventurer? Uh, hang on, the captain said you were an apprentice sailor. That's just my disguise. You gotta have a good cover story. You know, Sue just... No, I'll tell her. The problem was that Justin here was trying to ditch me. D ditch you? Now listen, Fina, Justin here is so terrible. Oh man, I just got girl talked on. And that's it. Hey, I'm a great adventurer, right? Right. You see how it was all Justin's fault, right? <laughs> I can see that you two are really good friends. You two are just too funny. I haven't laughed like this in ages. Say, Fina, tell us something about you. No fair just talking about us. Hmm, you're right. So, what would you like to know? Boop. Hmm, it's hard to say in just a few words. Well, we got plenty of time before we get to New Parm, so I'll tell you a little each day. Oh, that means we'll be swabbing the decks for a while, too. Ugh, the British sailors have it rough. <laughs> You'll be okay. I'll help too. It'll be fun if we all do it. Yeah, thank you, Fina. So, Justin, you want to be the greatest adventurer in the world? We're going to have the adventure. So we're going to the adventure society in New Parm. Fina, are you a member too? Nah, well, of course I'm a member. Great. I'll become a member too. I'll be an even better adventurer. I guess so. I'll go with you on your adventure. That sounds fun. Where do I live? Uh, I do live near Parm. I uh, New Parm. I live alone. It's a carefree life. Alone? Wow, you're tough, Fina. Don't you get lonely? Both my parents died long ago. I used to live with my big sister, but not anymore. Wow, living alone in the new world? Fina, that's so cool. It's getting dark. Something's happening. I don't like that wind. And suddenly the seagulls. I'm going to see the captain. Justin and Sue, you ought to return to your quarters. See ya. Oh, she was laughing so happily and suddenly she's so serious. What's wrong? Say, look, Justin, suddenly there are no seagulls at all. Oh, you're right. I think something interesting's going to happen. Let's go check it out, Sue. Oh my god, so stupid. 
Where do I go to check it out, though? I'm up here on a crane, but that doesn't seem to really achieve anything right now. When Fina arrives, she makes the whole ship seem bright and beautiful, like a flower in bloom. Eh, it certainly did get lively. <laughs> lively, you say? More like pandemonium, I think. Fuck. Fuck. Move. You guys are getting into my fucking way. Gotta cut it out, man. I guess we go to the bridge and overhear them talking. Captain, a gale's come up and the sea's rough. Strange clouds are approaching, too. This is trouble. I'll assemble them in. But not only that, I have a bad premonition. Look, Sue, they call this a chart. It's a map of the ocean. Oh, Justin, you're so mean. I'm too short, so I can't see. Fina, just what's happening? Is something wrong? Nothing to worry about, Justin and Sue. Go back to your quarters and rest. Justin, let's go back to our quarters. Looks like some big trouble. Captain, we have to change course by as much as we can. Quickly, assemble the men. But, Fina, that bad premonition of yours, could it be the legendary ghost ship? Not that ship again. Cut that out. It's just a superstition. Oh, ghost ship? Tell me about it, too. Justin, didn't you hear? I told you to go rest in your quarters. No fair. Can't we stay just a little? This is not a child's game of adventure. Do, be good and do as I say. Miss Fina. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Come on, deck right away. What did he? Captain, tell the men to make sure they act calm. The passengers will panic. Peace. I can't stand it. This really is the ghost ship. We're doomed. Every every game like from the pre 2000s has a fucking ghost ship. Like for real, straight up. Someone name some exceptions, because I'm like 99% sure that a lot of games, a lot of JRPGs pre 2000, like had ghost ships. <sighs> Wait, Justin, look at that. Hmm. I don't know about you. That looks a little bit like a ghost ship. Not trying to make anybody nervous, but like on a scale of one to ghost ship, we're like at a solid five out of seven. That. Um, that was a really awkward ending that FMV. <laughs> I don't, did, did, did Grandia just crash? Like, what's, okay, nope, okay, we're back. Incredible, a real ghost ship, incredible. Perfect five out of seven, that's right. Wow, really has the whole mood down. I've decided, my first great adventure is going to be on that ghost ship. How hopeless, isn't there a single real man of the sea on this ship? Hey, that's Fina's voice. Over there, Justin. What we know for sure right now is, unless we do something about that mystery ship, we won't make it to Alencia alive. At this rate, it involves not only the sailors, but the passengers too. Show them a sailor's grit and guts. Come on, Captain, instruct your men. No, we're done for. A ghost ship has really appeared. We're all gonna die now. That's just a shipwreck. The ghost ship is a superstition. Anyway, we have to fix the ship. You know, ever you see, ever since that ship appeared, our, our ship can't move, even with the engine at full speed. Ah, pull yourself together. We've gotta work together or we'll all drown. But Fina, what can we do? We're up against a ghost ship. We're just sailors, right? If the ship doesn't move, we can't do anything. 
Don't act so hopeless. Aren't you men of the sea? I'll solve the mystery of that ship. So who will go with me to board that ship? Isn't there even one brave man? Uh, hello there. Don't worry, Fina. We'll go with you. Justin? Now look, you guys. Even these little kids are showing some bravery. Is there no brave man among you who will go with me? I, I told you, I'll, I'll go with you on that ship. I'll bust up any ghost. Ghosts? Oh, you don't get it. Listen, Justin, if you believe in ghosts, you'll never become an adventurer. Justin and Sue, you just wait on the ship. It finally became a real adventure. No fair that you get to do all the fun things alone. Justin, you're thinking too simply. Adventure isn't child's play. You could even lose your life. Think like that and a real adventure would be way too dangerous. You don't have enough experience. If I don't go, who's going to go? I finally get to go on something like an adventure. I'm an adventurer too. You know the situation, don't you? There's no proof that you'll be any help at all, Justin. That ship won't let me bring along someone who'll get in the way. My intuition tells me so. But I'm worried about you, Fina. How can I let a girl go? Oh, Justin, come on, dude. A girl? How rude. I'm a pro-adventurer. I'm not so clueless that an amateur like you needs to worry about me. Ah, I can't stand it. I'll do it myself, then. Let's go, Sue. Huh? But... Oh, what do I do? Ready to cross the ghost ship, just as you said, Fina. No time to be fooling around. Okay, okay, Justin, let's go together. But if you get in the way even a little, promise to come back right away, okay? All right, of course, just leave it to me. Come on, let's stop fooling around and go. Justin, Sue, what can Fina do? She's one level above, uh, Justin, makes sense. Arrow whip and knife hurl. Ah, and she knows some magic. That's kind of cool. Burn, motherfucker. Oh, well. So she's just really good all the way across. Her move's kind of low, but I don't think that matters that much. She looks pretty fucking dope. Be careful, Fina. Sure, I'll be sure to solve the mystery of that ship. Hey, don't forget that I'm coming too. All right, we roll. We get a save point? <laughs> wow, this is an incredible ship. It looks like a real ghost ship. Are you chickening out, Justin? Ghosts are just fantastic stories. Don't be ridiculous. I'm not afraid of a ship like this. But, Justin, how do we get down? How do we get down? We get down like this. Oh, that Justin. Justin, wait! Dumbass kid. This is such a thrill. Don't get too excited, Justin. Who knows what will happen? Sorry, sorry. My adventure's blood is calling. I can't help it. <laughs> Our save point. Can a brother get a save point? I think we can go down from here. I'll go first so you two follow me. Nah, wow, pitch black. Can't see a thing. You two, no carelessness. Watch your feet. I could do this in my sleep. A first-rate adventurer, no problem. Hey, what's this? It's soft and warm and... Justin, you pervert! Ugh. Oh. Anime! 
Anime. Anime. Mm. Justin, what do you think you're doing? Ow, it's, it's your fault stopping when you're suddenly in front. Oh, just forget it. Anyway, let's go. We can't be wasting time. <laughs> Justin, your face is red. Perfect. All right, and uh, funny enough, it is three sharp. Um, rather than give you guys a little extra time today, we're probably just going to go ahead and stop this so that everyone can can hit the action fresh and hard tomorrow at 12. Thank you, everyone, for watching. And if you are watching and you have not yet followed the stream, please follow the stream because that way you can see when I go live in the future and you can join us. Uh, thank you for your time. Have a great day. Bye-bye.